Trial number seven of eight here at Tapcourt Park, Melton. Another two-horse trial for the Trotters. This is a T6 or better, though, but it's once again over the 2,240 metres from behind the mobile. Two pretty good Trotters here. Number one, Mr. Independent, and number two, Elder Baron Shades. Green light, they're racing. Mr. Independent from the pole is going to be the leader. And Outer Baron Shade, six metres away, drops onto its back to sit in second. So, Mr. Independent, this Sean Cattell, trained in Greek tonight, driven by Greg Sugars, leads the way. The gelding by last sunset from Sweden Petit, that has had 50 career starts, eight wins, 10 seconds, one third, and his best mile rate is a 159.2. It's been a good horse over the years, Mr. Independent shows. By four metres with Elder Baron Shades in second placing on his back. Elder Baron Shades, uh, well known as one of the better trotters around, I suppose, the son of Sundon from uh, Tawana Glass, and has had the 40 starts uh, for 17 wins, seven seconds, four thirds, and of course is a Group 1 Classic winner. 47.2 was the lead time, so obviously it's a two horse trot, uh, but it's not too bad for a two horse trot, even though they are very good trotters themselves, both Mr. Independent, Elder Baron Shades. So they went for the lead time in 47.2. And Mr. Independent continues to show in the way. Mr. Independent ran second in the Ogin Cup at this course in January. Shows in front from Elder Baron Shades. Uh, as I said, was a Group 1 Classic winner as a three-year-old as they go through the first quarter in 31.3. Elder Baron Shades, of course, won that Classic in New South Wales, winning the Derby up there. In 2012, also the winner of the Winter Trotters Cup in 2013 and this year winner of the John Slack Memorial Trotters Cup at Ballarat and also the Sundons Gift over this course and over at this course here at Melton. Lisa Miles trains and drives and he's four metres adrift of Mr Independent who leads. He's gone sectionals of 47.2 for the lead time and a first quarter of 31.3 and now he's gone a second quarter of 30.7 to the half in 62 flat. And the first or... They went to the 1200 meters in 40, or they went to the 1200 meters in 118.61, and they went to the 800 meters in 149.35. So there's some other little sectionals there with no change to the order. So it's a four meter lead for Mr. Independent from Elder Baron Shades, who now hooks off the inside, and Mr. Independent is shaken up by Sugars. Three meters of Elder Baron Shades coming off his back to start the race. 400 meters to go. 30.6 third quarter, 61 free the middle half. And it is Mr. Independent, a neck in front from Elder Baron Shades, who's now up on the outside to have his little hit out. And they're going to sprint the last furlong in the straight. Mr. Independent on the pegs. The neck, Elder Baron Shades to the outside is trying to run Mr. Independent down. Both sort of unextended, these two trials. Mr. Independent, though, has had the run in front. He's cleared from Elder Baron Shades. And Mr. Independent beat home Elder Baron Shades. Beat him by five metres. 28-9 last quarter. 2-1 free the rate. Two horse trials. In both trials, the winner was one and second was two. The leader won both. So one, Mr. Independent, driven by Greg Sugars, trained by Sean Cattell. As I said, been a good horse over the years and he wins from the Group 1 winning Classic Trotter, Elder Baron Shades, in second. So first, one, second, two. And last, the gross time, 248.9. Uh, the mile rate, 213, the last mile in 21.6, and the last half was 59.5. Margins, or the margin, the winning margin of the winner was 5.5 metres. So first one, Mr. Independent, and second placing, and last was two Elder Baron Shades. One, two, gross time in 248.9, mile rate 21.3, last mile in 21.6, and the last half in 59.5, and the winning margin of Mr. Independent over Elder Baron Shades was five and a half metres. One, two, trial seven.